Welcome to Reanimator Reviews. I'm Rayanne, and today I'm going to be talking about Afterlife. It is a 2009, not really a horror movie, more like a drama, thriller, mystery kind of thing. The director's name, I am ready to mangle. It's Agnieszka Wotowicz Voslu. Can't pronounce anything for the life of me. My apologies, but I did want to at least attempt to say her name. So, the movie starts out with a couple with a strained relationship that is brought to an untimely end due to a car accident. Anna, the young lady in the relationship, does wake up in a funeral home and then begins to try to convince the funeral home owner, Elliot, that she can't possibly be dead because she is, in fact, talking and breathing. And he kind of you know, acts like this has happened before. He's had other dead people trying to convince him that they're not dead, which is weird. But it turns out he does have some kind of gift that he's able to speak to the dead. While all of this goes on, it follows uh, the emotional story of Paul, the young man in the relationship, and his struggle of trying to stop loving her and trying to stop really trying to view her body as well as Anna accepting what is her ultimate fate and also what is Anna's ultimate fate because it's kind of unclear is she completely dead could she still be alive is there something maybe in between is it just that black or white with life and death so my likes I'm a huge fan of Christina Ricci even you know as young as Wednesday to where she is now I love her and as she is an adult, and it doesn't sound creepy with me saying this, as she's an adult, there's a huge chunk of this movie where she is just butt naked. And it's nice. And I think anyone could appreciate that. Another like of mine is that Justin Long, I was just having this conversation. I feel like he's such an underrated actor. I really love his work. And watching him cry made me want to cry. Seeing him in such an emotional state really did, you know, make me feel emotional and made me feel, you know, how I would feel if I was going through the same thing as he was going. My dislikes. The twist in the whole movie, which of course there's a twist. I feel like kind of was given away a bit too early in the movie if you were paying attention and kind of ruined it. Uh, the twist was kind of also a little meh. It wasn't anything groundbreaking. Whatever lesson there was supposed to be in this movie, I don't know what it was. I don't know really what the point of the movie was because it just kind of fizzled out. And the pacing felt, at least to me, that it took a really long time. I don't think this movie was that long, but it felt like it was really long. And that took me out of it. I have a admittedly I have a pretty short attention span but I couldn't it didn't keep me engaged and that was a bummer so I do give this movie a 1.5 out of 5 1.5 mostly for Christina Ricci's boobies and Justin Long is awesome yeah uh, would I recommend it to anyone probably not but a lot of people have way different opinions than mine that's fine to me it just didn't keep me entertained and that's ultimately what a movie's supposed to do so i found this movie on shutter streaming like everything i find sometimes there is a physical copy that you could find but it seems like more and more it's harder to find less popular movies on oh. dvd unless you're really really going to search for it that's up to you if you really actually want to search for this or just get a prime membership because prime is bomb and if I didn't have to, I wouldn't leave my house because of Amazon Prime. So hashtag not spawns. But what did you think about the movie? Did you like it? Did you like Christina Ricci naked? Because like if you didn't, what what is your life? Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Like the video if you did like it. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'd love to have you. And hit the bell for all notifications of my uploads. You can also find me on Facebook at Reanimator Reviews and Twitter at Reanimator and hell yeah, Christina Ricci.